Hello, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello, my name is Jihan Rami Sumantri And I'm from group 5 Language Materi- Materials Evolution and Design Class B And today I will continue the presentation That have been delivered by my friend before My friends before It talked about adapting ELT materials And today I will deliver about significant consideration in adapting textbooks so please focus and i'm sorry if there's something that can disturb you in the middle of the video i'm sorry because yes <laughs> and the first that you have to uh, talk about in significant consideration in, in adapting textbook is modifying content Content may need to be changed because it may not suit the target learners, perhaps because of the factors related to the learner's age, gender, social class, occupation, religion, or cultural background. That you have to know first uh, about the religion, and here is a sensitive issue that you have to consider it really carefully in the textbooks. And the second or the next is adding or adding or deleting content. The book adding or deleting content it's about the book may contain too much or too little for the program. For example, a course may focus primarily on listening and speaking skills, and writing activities activities in the book will be omitted in the books. Yes, in the textbook. And the next is. Reorganizing content. I think all of you have been heard or, or have been experienced before. A teacher may decide to reorganize the syllabus of the book and arrange the units in what she or he considers considers a more suitable order or within a unit. She or he may decide not to follow the sequence of the activities in the unit, but to reorder them for a particular reason so the teacher usually uh, reorder or reorganize the textbooks that they got to suit to make it suitable for their stu- students and maybe and sometimes they change the syllabus or the activity in the textbooks that uh, to follow the suitable one for the class i think that's all from from me and Uh, thank you. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.